Hello, good afternoon, everyone. I am back. Um, I want to share precision craft glue that just came in, and it comes in a nice little um, box. This is their um, glue here made in the USA. So I'm super excited to try this glue out. Um, it's supposed to be just as good as Art Glitter Glue Hi Young Sue. Um, and never tried it, so let's see what it's all about. And I'm going to do a quick test. You all know we got to test this glue. I love the little box. It's pretty neat. Hey, Miss Jackie. Let's see. Yeah, I'm opening it wrong. Gosh, this is hard. Look at that. That's a pretty big bottle. So we got a nice little um, bottle like that. This one's nice. I can tell this one's really nice for my hand. It's not a little bit hard, but it's cute, and I could probably pour that in here. It comes with a little topper, and it comes with your little needle. And here is the info on them. The ultra fine tips. Um, has a fine tip, ultra fine tip, and a storage pin all in this little compartment thing. And then it has cleaning tips after each use. And I guess I should be using my glasses so I can read this stuff better. Twist on the tips. So you twist on the tips. So I guess you can store them. Nice little storage container. It has a little um, stainless steel pin. But we have a little tutorial on how to make your little toppers. So this one is a storage tip. Um, this is the ultra fine tip. And this is the fine tip. So let's try. Going to Crafting Club, Cubs newsletter. You can text them there. 8178. 732766 um, and text cuz. Pretty neat. And has a little pan so you can clean the tip. But you can also put a little bit of hot water and soak them in. Put that on. So we're going to do the ultra fine. We're going to do a little test. We're going to test craft tacky, art glitter. And you guys know I love my fabric tuck. Okay. So we're gonna test these. Let's say, let's see, pre precision. I have a hard time with my Spanish and the um, keys and R and stuff like that. Precision, craft glue, inspiring creative imagination, scrapbook paper, artwork, decoration, craft glitter. The things I do like about this is that it is made in the USA. Box is tougher than you I know, right? So it's non-toxic, safe to use, create more, refill less, dries clear, hides the mess, precision tip, fine control, multiple tips, more choices, flexible, resist crackling, wrinkle resistant, less wrinkles, clump resistant, stay smooth, design touch, strong hold, design durable, long lasting, thaws if frozen, use all year round. And so their website is, I'm going to have something on my nail. Website is www.barely.art. So we're going to test this. It's made in Arlington, Texas. So it's even, it's, it's awesome. I love it. Um, twist the cap off. Choose the tip. Apply a thin layer of glue to the surface. Set. Time is five minutes. And pure whole cure is 24 hours. Times can vary depending on temperature and humidity, which we all know that. After each use, clean the tip with warm water. If buildup occurs, use the cleaning pen to clear away any blockage. Store 
with green topper or flat cap at room temperature. So you're going to store it. Always remove your tip, I guess, um, and store it with that. Hey, Sonia, how are you? How are you feeling, Sonia? I hope you guys are all staying safe. We got the fine tip on, the ultra fine tip, sorry. What I do like about the bottle, it's very easy on the hand, especially since I do have arthritis in my hand. These are a little bit, this one in particular is super hard, but I love it. This one's soft. I love this one. I do. Of course, they fat the time. All right, let's do a little test. Y'all know I love my fabric top. Let's let's start with um, let's actually start. Let me put all this stuff back in so we're not losing. I love the little storage container. That is ooh, pretty usable. Let's start with um, this one, which is the fat uh, tonic craft tacky glue. I've got my little papers here. Hopefully I can get it out because this bottle is kind of For some reason I almost have problems. Yeah, hold on. Not having it. Not having it. I poured it over here. I poured some over here, so. You guys saw me pouring it the other day, just so you know. I'm not cheating. Um, but for some reason, I always have, as much as I like that glue, I always have issues with it. It's like, I Not really a paper crafter, guys, but you guys know. There's a lot of fabric tack whenever I do any paper related stuff. I'm basically a jack of all trade master of none. I'm not even going to smush that. Spread it. Some people spread it, I don't. Set that one aside. Let's use fabric tack. Fabri-Tech is acetone base, which means that you can take your nail polish remover whenever it gets gummy, pour some in. I always use, as soon as I use it, I always put the topper on so that it doesn't get gummy. I did put more, more glue on this because you can't. 
not anymore. One thing I'll tell you, our glitter glue is very runny. If you guys can see, it was, it's so much runnier than the other glues. And even tacky glue. A lot more runnier. Super runny. can't see the chat. I don't know why. Something about Facebook and how Facebook has done a big change or I can't even tag anybody. I'm on that one side. Let's do the barely, barely art. Not as runny as art glitter. I like the hand, I like the fact that I can grip this bottle. It's not bulky on my hands, and I got arthritis in my hands. I like the tip. can see warping um, all right warping very bad warping no warping no warping so believe it or not um, there's there's even on my craft tacky there's a little warping but not as bad as this one look Not as bad as that. Okay. I can't get in here without lifting it up. Um, so right here, look at that. You can do it over here, but this is really bad over here. So yeah, this is fabric pack. I guess I can take a straight paper. See that? This is um, art glitter, and you can even see right here, like you can see it right there, where you don't see that groove on the other glues. Um, this is just the regular cardstock I'm stamping up. You can see it right around there. You see that? That's our glitter. That's craft tacky from Tonic, which is a lot cheaper. It's like three dollars a bottle. The only problem that I have with the craft tacky is that it does seep on the side. So if I can find a bottle like this, this bottle is awesome. I did try to purchase this one. This this 
this is one of those icing bottles that was suggested to me, not good. I poured it in here the other day and it started to seep out. Um, this bottle here, I keep getting it clogged, so I have to pour it to see it comes out the side, which is what this does. This bottle here, if I can find one similar for this, it'd be awesome. Um, but you can definitely um, see differences. There's craft tacking. Here's a plain cardstock. This one here is the art glitter. And what I don't like, see that? You can see, literally see that. It's very noticeable. Here's Fabri-Tac. Now, again, this is my favorite glue because it does not work. Yes, you get gummy, but if you put your stopper in each time you use it, and if it starts to get really, really gummy, you can use acetone, your nail polish remover, a couple drops of it inside, shake it up a little, and it's good to go. Um, wonderful. You can also use your coupons for this, you know. Um, of course, right now it's kind of hard, but once we get back and operating. But here it is, look. There's crap tacky. Fabric tack, card stock in the middle. There's part glitter glue compared to craft tacky glue. You see art glitter? Here's art glitter. Put it back to back. Art tacky, craft tacky, art glitter. Look at that. Can you see that? And I'm putting it together. Look. You guys see that? Hi, Kathy. This is why I don't like it's expensive. Um, and here is our new one, which did really good as far as the warping. Again, here's an expensive bottle compared to the Barely Art. Look at that. You see the difference? Again. Turn it back to back. Art glitter. This is art glitter. Barely. Look at that. Art glitter. Barely. Now, barely compared to our just regular cardstock that's not glued. Oh. Not bad at all. Pretty nice. I like that. That passed the test. And see it with um, Craft Tacky. It's a lot more flatter than Craft Tacky, believe it or not. And you guys know I love tonic Craft Tacky glue. And it still has not as noticeable. Look at that. That is pretty bad. That's because it's so watery. Um, not as noticeable as tonics. Look at that. I mean, pretty, pretty darn bad. Um, it's a regular cardstock to compare. You can compare notes here. You see that? Tonic art glitter glue in the center and just a cardstock on the outside. Pretty noticeable. Here is barely tonic. And I got my little carve, a curve here on my tonic. Not as bad as our glitter. You know, our glitter really took took a beat down on this one. Um, but see that? Our glitter really took a huge beat down there. really massive beat down but this barely wow all I can say it is almost compared to fabric tack love it absolutely love it I am going to talk to the owner because I talked to her I will probably carry it in the store um, absolutely love it I love the tips 
the fact that you have different options and then you have your little um, securing one that you can pop in here. Um, let's see if that'll, nope, I gotta remove the tip and put this one on, but I love it. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely love it. So I'm just gonna probably run this in a little bit of hot water, keep it next to me so that I, look at that, love it. I'm gonna run it with some hot water, clean it up a little. I'll probably forget, you know, cause that's just normal, we're, we're humans. I'll probably forget to change out the toppers cause y'all know me, I'm a little bit on the lazy side of life, but I absolutely love it. I love their bottle. The fact that I can grip it a lot better. It's almost like this icy bottle. This one, as much as I love my prep, it's so hard on my hands. Ah, it's hard. This one, I'm sorry, guys. I don't like this blue. I don't at all. Don't like it whatsoever. Um, Y'all know I love my fabric tack. Um, I love it for metals. I love it for paper. It's great on fabric. It's a little bit longer on fabric, believe it or not. But I just love this blue. Um, and now I have fallen in love with Barely Art. It is awesome. It is amazing. So, guys, there it is. You guys saw it here. Um, Art Glitter failed the test once again. Um, and uh, I am in love with um, Barely. I mean, wow. It barely did anything. It, bar it barely worked. <laughs> Just, it didn't even work. It didn't even phase it. Look at that. That is amazing stuff. This is what you guys want. You don't want your projects. One of the things I absolutely hate is to put down, I'm not a paper crafter. Mm. But I do do my paper crafts every now and then. And when I do, and I get this reaction, I don't like it. Not at all, not at all. Now I will um, leave these dry because it says 24 hours to cure. I'm gonna leave it dry and then I'm gonna come back and see if I can take it apart. And um, again, um, you guys do your test, look at that. You can see that? Can you guys guess which one's in the outside? Can you guys, can you guys tell which one this one is? Can you guys tell, what is this one here in the outside? You guys open up a separate window to see what you guys are saying. I'm gonna to to open up another window. I will, I will get that. I will get, I will order you some. That is amazing stuff. I'm gonna to talk to the owner today. We are definitely, definitely in love with this glue. Um, the fact that it's made in the USA, that's to me, that is awesome. It's here in Texas. Um, and we were talking about maybe getting together as soon as all this is said and done. So I love the fact that it's made in the USA. It did the job. And I don't know if you guys can tell but can you guys tell me which one is the one that's in the outside? Can you tell? Art glitter, right, right. Um, it is absolutely art glitter. It is not, watch, I'll, I'll show you. So you guys can see. Not lying about it. Look, art glitter. Art glitter is not that great. I'm sorry, guys. I hate to say it. Um, I would not sell a glue if I saw that. I mean, I would not put myself out there and say, oh, yeah, I'm going to carry this glue because it's supposed to be great. Uh uh. But I'm going to get this result. No. But I love the fact that this, this one here. 
unbelievable 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 it even it even beat my my tonic one and you guys know i love tonic it even beat tonic not by much but it did it is flat as a board it's totally flat look at that look at that flat flat not so flat look not so flat a little bit of warping here not as bad this is really bad this one here it is really bad look really really bad so there you have it the battle of the glues I did it again um absolutely did it again guys so I saw it here. We tested it. I'm going to go talk to the owner of uh, Barely Blue because I absolutely love it. Um, you're interested in getting a set just like I got here. I'm going to do this on YouTube. I'm going to probably share this on YouTube. Um, let me know. I am going to probably post this on YouTube as well. But let me know if you're interested in some of this glue. I will get the prices for you guys sometime this afternoon, if not tomorrow. Um, but in the meantime, guys, please stay safe. Love you all. I will try to get my homework done. It's sociology, so not digging it. But read about the um, education here in the United States. So yeah. Yay! <laughs> um, so I will try to pop in and work on a project with you guys um, today. So um, if you're interested in getting some of this blue, let me know. Um, oh, my computer kind of quiet down. Until next time, guys, be safe. Bye.